This is my CNC foam cutting setup and I'm going to show you everything about how it works and how I cut foam cores for RC airplanes. So first of all, here is the machine. You can see it's got a left side and a right side. Each one of those sides can move in two directions. We've got the X axis on this side, the Y axis, and same thing over here. We've got the second X axis and a Y axis. And each one of those is controlled by a motor, which is attached to a threaded rod, which goes through a nut is attached to this whole thing and it's all attached to drawer slides. These are just drawer slides from Home Depot. Now all the wires from the motors, these gray wires here, they all go into this box. And that I bought from a company called Xylotex. Now that box is connected to the parallel port of my computer over here. And to control that box and the motors, I use a software called Mach 3, which is like a generic CNC controller software that you can get for free off the internet. And Mach 3 runs code called G-Code. This over here is G-code. Now the way I get G-code is I wrote this software in MATLAB where I enter in all the parameters of the wing that I want to cut and then I click the run button and it comes up with a display of the airfoil with the curve added and that writes the code to a text file which I then copy and paste into here. Now I've got everything set up where I can cut a foam wing right now. And I've got a block of foam sitting in the machine. And I've got a power supply over here. And that is connected at either end of the wire. One in there and one in there. So if I turn this power supply on, that's going to get hot. Then I just have to go over here and push this button and it's going to start running.
now it's done cutting. So I'll turn off the power supply. And we'll see how this one turned out. And there is a really nice looking foam core for a wing. You can see that is just about perfect. It's looking really good. And that is how I cut foaming cores. Thanks for watching.